Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Yakuza 0. This is your boy Kalagul Gaming and you know how we do things around here. We're gonna take care of some side quests today, so without further ado, let's get into some shit. Huh? What the hell is that? I don't recall there being a statue there. Well, here's a well-made statue. What's it doing in a place like this though? Pretty amazing detail too. Wonder what they make this stuff out of. Huh? Am I hearing voices now? Ah, whatever. The statue though. Sure looks lifelike. Doesn't feel like plaster at all. What are you doing? Like smacking the motherfucker or tickling him? Whoa, whoa, what the hell, man? You're alive! You're a phony! Hey, now, buddy, that tickled! No touching, please. Think of my act like a classy strip club. You can look, but keep your hands off the performer. Performer? That's what I am. A street performer. I go by the name of Takokichi. What I'm doing now is performance art. I'm playing the part of a statue, as you can see. Okay, I get the picture. You're really good. I thought you were actually a statue. But uh, why are you doing this here? Oh, didn't you know? This area is the holy land for buskers. What the hell is a busker? Holy land? The hell? Heaven, not hell. The heavy foot traffic means we get a very steady audience. And the locals here love a good comedy bit, so they have a great eye for quality. It's my lucky spot. Well, I guess if you put it that way, this bridge does have its benefits. So you practice in your art? Yes, that would be a fair description. Ultimately, I hope to be a street performer who inspires little kids to dream big. I think street performances are entertainment that anyone can enjoy. From kids who just learn how to speak to the elderly forgetting words. I want to make people smile. That's a grand dream. Good on ya. Well, I wish you the best. I'll be moving on now. Sorry to disturb and tickling your ears. Oh no, it's fine. See ya! I'm a statue man! Don't talk to statues! Alrighty then. You there! Eh? Hey! Hey! You there! Listen! Can I get you to come over here? Nah, motherfucker, you come over here! What's with this weirdo? Rise of the Dragon? He doesn't have any pants on! <laughs> Thanks for coming over. I'm saved. What's your problem, dude? What do you want? <laughs> nani ga nani? What the hell? You! Where the hell are your pants? That's why I called you over. Do me a favor? Can I borrow your pants? <laughs> your pants! The pair you got on right now! As you can see, I had my bottom pants taken. Come on, pal. I'm in trouble here. Uh, nuts to that. I give you my pants and I'm the one standing around in my skivvies. You take me for a fool! Oh, don't be like that! Can, can the cameraman just fucking relocate? No self-respecting young fella with a whole future ahead of him can go out in town with his underwear exposed, right? Huh? Did you hear me the first time, motherfucker? If I give you my pants, then I'm the one swaying the breezy! <sighs> what a waste of time! My fault for Karen. Huh? Hold up! Leave me your pants! Uh, bruh, this is gonna go south for you real fucking quick if you don't let up. You want them so bad? You can try to rip them off me. Fine, screw it. I'll put your underwear on display for the whole world to see when I jack those pants. Choice of words. Don't, don't, none of that. Even if you see a jack walking down the street, don't fucking call out to that guy if his name is Jack, motherfucker. 
menacing man. I forgot the controls of this shit. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, hey up. I'm sorry, really? I was out of line. <sighs> For fuck's sake, man. What is with you, man? Explain from the top. I, I'm Toru, and I go to Sutton North High. Just before you came by, I was mucked by Bonten Hunter. By the Bonten Hunter? What the fuck is a Bonten Hunter? Uh, well, to put it simply, Bonten pants are like school uniform pants, but they got high waist and are super puffy around the thighs. The, uh, cool kids wear them. No, I know what a Bontan is. So, the Bontan Hunter attack guys wearing Bontan and acting bigger than their britches. He beats them up and takes their Bontan as a trophy. So, the gist is, this guy kicked your ass and left you with your tidy whites on display. And now, you got your ass kicked by me, so that makes a doubler for one night. That's a crazy night. Oh. Pretty much. There's nothing I could have done about it, though. The Bonton Hunter is really this weird guy. Weird? Like how? There's something messed up about him. Big guy, but likes to jump people from behind and pummel them. And on his back... His back? Oh great, what's the tat? Yep. Nah, he's got this tiny student backpack. <laughs> student backpack? Like from elementary school? See what I mean? He's just messed up in the head. You try getting jumped by someone that loopy, it's just flat out scary man, there's no way to win that shit. Uh. He's been going at it every day too. The way things are going, there's gonna be more victims going pantsless around here. How is this not on the news, motherfucker? Well, now I'm one story richer and a shit ton of time the poor. This all's got nothing to do with me. Huh? Whoa, 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 hold on now. Please, you can't leave me here like this. Can you get my pants back for me? They say he shows up near Magutaku a lot. The bastard's tough, but I bet you can take him. My Bontan is good as back with you on the hunt for the hunter. Please. <sighs> okay. Forget you saw me, homie. But this backpack toting guy, gotta admit it's kinda intriguing. He does his hunting near Magutaku, huh? Alright, uh, let's see what we got. What the fuck was that? Oh, I got a text message. Cool. Where, where was that place? Okay, let's, let's uh, have a quick detour. What the fuck? Later. Later. There's so much shit going on right here now. Hey, yep. Camera, where the fuck am I now? No. Oh my god. What's that girl doing by herself? She lost? Alright, we're not dealing with her now, goddammit. Crazy doll kid in the middle of the night. Nope. Not gonna pop off like that. Nice bonten you got there! Say what? I'll be taking those Bontan. You talking to me? Maybe you need glasses, cause these pants ain't Bontan. This here is what you call a tuxedo. Stop talking like a kid, just drop your pants. Are you the hunter I heard about, huh? Got the school backpack and everything. Wanna tell me what your deal is? You don't wanna take them off? I'll help you do it. It's more fun that way. Healing's better than stealing. <sighs> huh? Not exactly a reasonable type, huh? You made your choice. I'm gonna have fun ripping those pants off you. Yo, man, some of the fucking shit this game throws at you. What the hell? 
I I lost this one eye chump? Gotta hand it to you. You ain't half bad. But what's up with the get up, huh? Oh my gosh, it's Ryujikun! Can you get the fuck back to Persona 5, please? Uh -huh. Wow, you're right! Mm -hmm. We're sorry. Please leave him alone. Please, please let him go. Ryujikun was doing this for us. Oh, for crying out loud. What now? He's got some nerve falling asleep after all that. But you're telling me a brute this size is still in elementary school? Hi. Yep, Ryujikun is a classmate of ours. He's always been like this, right? Mm hmm. A school backpack never ever looked right on him. So you got a sixth grade. So you've got a sixth grade Hulk ripping off the. Hmm. Huh? Yeah, what was that all about? They're really scummy, huh? Hi. Why is that? Why did you do that? Oh, so he's just doing it just to um, impress you guys. He's a Yakuza. Alright, when we were little, we all played together. But when our parents found out about Ryoji-kun's dad, they said we couldn't play with him anymore. Now, Ryoji-kun is all by himself at school. Even the teachers are all careful and polite around him, like this kid. So he's the son of a Yakuza, huh? There's gotta be plenty of those around here. Why is that such a big deal? Because Ryoji-kun isn't th a regular Yakuza. He's like some big shot in the Omi Alliance. Okay. I look like I'm from Sota North High. <laughs> hey, dude, you're talking to a kid right now. I'm not in school. Good. Sure can. He better have me some. He, he better. He better have some rewards for me. <sighs> Is that? Yeah, that's the street performer guy. Drew himself a good-sized audience too. Nice to see. Hmm. What the fuck is going on? What is he doing? Making smoke signals? I better get closer to see what's up. Yeah, I piss off. Piss off! Yo, Tokokichi! You pulled in a good crowd. Yes, that's been good, at least. 
I gotta take a shit though. So, you seem to be trying to tell me something before. What's up? Yes, I, uh, I need to use the rest. <laughs> I could have written this game, dog. Oh, my. Mama, why is that man talking to the statue? It's just a little different. It's rude to stare. Thanks to you, people think I'm a nut job. Sorry, but you're the one talking to a statue. So why are you calling me over about your uh, problems? There's a pizza place right over there. Why not make a beeline for the crapper? No way. I can't do that. There's a little kid watching. If he saw a statue suddenly spring to life, he might be traumatized for life. I guess that's true. What you want me to do? I don't want to shatter that boy's dream. But I need to go shatter that toilet. I need to go relieve myself. My eyes are floating. My eyes are floating? What should I do? Hey man, ignoring nature's call never ends well. Why don't you just sneak off when that little tyke ain't watching? Sneak off when he's not looking? That's it! What? You got another recipe? I got a bad feeling about this. I really hate to ask, but can you distract these people? Just long enough for me to sneak off into the pizza place. Oh, if you're gonna compensate me, then we're talking. Yes, yes. Let's help him. Okay, how do I get these folks' attention? I guess I can try raising my voice. Well, all right. I'll try wailing like a banshee. Yeah! Nobody gave a fuck. Mama, what the fuck is wrong with that man? <laughs> oh, this is as mortifying as it gets. All right. Um, uh, insults. Faster than that, mate. <sighs> what the heck? There ain't no UFO up there. Uh, forget it. This statue is the real deal. Really, my guy? Huh? What? Am I imagining things? Wasn't that statue over this way a bit more? Well, at least he managed to scoot a little. Alright. Next... We are going to sing a song. Sunaoni, I love you. Todoke yo oki to you love me. Tsutawaru sa kimi ni ni au karasu no kutsu o sagaso. Oh, I need that. She does my ringtone, dog. <laughs> Gotti! Faster than that, dog. <sighs> Why are you so fucking. <laughs> you idiot! You're facing the wrong way! Statue, son? One-eyed Willy? <laughs> I wasn't pressing around! Oh 
fucking hell. Why does it always end up with this? See what you started now, bitch. Huh? Yeah, you better be sorry, motherfucker. Spineless coward. Blowhard. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There you go. Alright, give me my reward, man. What do I get for my troubles? Um, hello? Did you make it to the crapper in time? There goes an odd duck, but you gotta respect it ain't easy making people laugh or bringing them joy. Being an entertainer is as tough as any, any other business. Sweet. Got him. Alright, let's go return this guy's pants. And then we're gonna call it an episode right here. Piss off. Hey. Huh? You're that guy. Better have a reward for me, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, yes. This is it. My bunt and pants. Thanks so much. Uh. Huh? But no reward. Boy. All right, fuck it. I guess uh, we're not completely done with the quest yet. It should be around here somewhere. It might already be too late to help him, though. What the hell happened here? What's going on here? You did this all by yourself. Just a bunch of mooks. No matter how big a swarm they make, they're still worthless. What a waste of time. I gotta get home. I got math rules for homework. K What's your name? Alright, cool. Now we're done with the quest. We didn't get a reward for it, but maybe it will pay off in the future. Who knows? Anyway, I think we're gonna call it an episode right here. This has been your boy Kadago Gaming. I am out!